It appears that Terrence Steele is moving well with only allowing one sack last season, four quarterback hits, and 20 pressures out of 818 snaps. Terrence Steele was very much so missed, and we needed his flexibility, his power, his strength, and on top of that, his hand placement. Man, Terrence Steele was that force factor for us, and he was very, very, very needed in the tail end of the last season, especially on run. When the running backs ran behind Terrence Steele, they were able to gain more and more yards and more and more opportunities because he got that dog nasty mentality. So as you guys can see, Terrence Steele, he's moving pretty fast and good out here in practice and recovery stage. Now, of course, he don't have 300 or 280 pound defensive edge guy coming at him. Nevertheless, the, the recovery is very very tangible and now that you got that and understanding that yes 14 weeks post-surgery to his repair acl mcl and he's moving weight around with no brace meaning that he trusts his legs his lower body extremities so cowboys they got a tender on him for a second round draft pick now he can play for 3.3 million dollars i truly believe that the cowboys should stop playing around with fire Go ahead and sign this man up to a long-term contract, and you don't have to worry about right tackle at all. It looks like and appears like he is ahead of schedule, like the Cowboys said. But let's stop playing around with fire and get this man in the building for a long-term contract and focus on the left side of your offensive line. Post me your thoughts. Post me your concerns down below. Terrence Steele is ahead of schedule. Can't wait to see this man out there on the field for the 2023 season. DC for life. Salute.